How's it going guys? Welcome to another video. So we're going to uh, take another look at Kylo Ren versus Finn and racing from uh, the new Star Wars The Force Awakens. Star Wars Episode 7, The Force Awakens. So, yeah, there's a lot of speculation with, because uh, uh, this this does, this, this, there is like this thing among fans uh, with this scene. Uh, like Ray, like people keep talking about like, how Ray easily beats um, Kylo Ren and so forth. So we'll get into that after the video. So let's take another look at the, uh, the fight scene again. It's been a while since I last saw the uh, fight scene. Right, so here we go. One, two, three, go. Done yet. You're a, You're a monster. monster. It's just us now. Han Solo can't save you. I like it when he does that. It's like Go away, pain. No. Finn lasted quite like a good decent amount of time against uh, Kylo, despite him not being a Jedi. Focusing. Now, I still like that scene, but obviously some people have a problem with that scene in the movie. Um, so this still remains a bit of a, a topic in um, amongst Star Wars, you know, amongst the fans and stuff like that, on this particular scene. Uh, how Finn was able to last as long as he did against Kylo Ren, how Rey uh, suddenly knew how to like outdo at, at Kylo Ren with uh, lightsaber skills. And it's always it's been a bit of a a topic amongst the fans. So I'll start with Finn, right? Finn. The reason Finn managed to last as long, right, against Kylo Ren is because he is a soldier. He is a stormtrooper. Okay, he's been trained as far as I'm. As, as far as I can tell, he's been trained since he was a boy. Okay, they took him away from his family when he was very young and they've been training him. So you've got to believe that he has hand-to-hand uh, -hand combat skills, he's got, he's got, he's got skills with guns, he's, he's been trained, he's a soldier. Okay? And, you know, he's definitely had hand-to-hand -hand combat because we saw in the movie earlier uh, there was one stormtrooper that had that 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 weapon, like that weapon that folded out, and it was it's like it, it almost looked like something that a riot policeman would have, like to batter people with. Is it, is it a baton? I can't remember what it's called. Is it called a baton? Where well, you know the handle's there and the bar goes along here. Yeah. He had that weapon, didn't he? And he fought Finn with the lightsaber, and he had mad skills. He had mad skills with that. 
So I do have reason to believe that Finn has had good amount of training, good combat training. So, if it, so that's why I reckon he lasted as long as he did against Kylo Ren, because he has had training to fight. Even though he's not had that much uh, battle, ex like real life battle experience, he's been trained nonetheless how to fight. So that's why, that's my opinion on how I think Finn lasted as long as he did against Kylo. Right, so there's the issue with Ray. Ray able to fight off Kylo Ren and at matching with a lightsaber, like in skills and lightsaber skills. Um, well, when it comes to her force abilities, I think it is possible who hasn't, anyone that's force sensitive and they've had no training, I reckon it is possible for people who are force sensitive to pick up on very basic uh, force abilities. Um, but um, when it comes to lightsaber skills, I mean lightsaber, like lightsaber combat, I mean that's, it's a martial art. It's a, it's a fighting style and you need someone to teach you this stuff and for, for Ray just to suddenly outmatch uh, Kylo Ren in this scene seemed a bit, I don't know, just seemed a bit off to me. Like when I was watching the movie and she started getting the upper hand on Kylo Ren, um, I thought to myself, hold on a second, how is she, how, how is she beating him? She's got no like training with a lightsaber whatsoever and I thought to myself oh well, Kylo Ren is injured he did get blasted like right here with a, with the like, with a crossbow blaster so that might be a factor why Kylo, Kylo Ren might not have been fighting at his full potential he might not have been fighting at his full potential uh, because you saw that like, when he was fighting Finn the injury was really bothering him because he was like oh, he was like like he's like punching it to say like, like go away pain, like I'm, I can't deal with you right now, I'm fighting. And um, so that could be a factor why Kylo Ren started struggling when she started to fight back. But it still doesn't really explain her, her skill with a lightsaber, like how she just picked it up. Um, you could, all right, the only, my only explanation in this is that she is just unnatural. Okay, she is just unnatural. It just came naturally to her. As soon as she like closed her eyes and focused, and really tapped, like sort of tapped into her own uh, abilities and powers, um, I think the lightsaber skill just came naturally to her, and she just knew what to do with the lightsaber. So that's that's the only explanation for it. So uh, because cause if Kylo if if Kylo Ren was fully trained in the dark side. And he got beat by Ray, like in this movie. If he was like fully trained in Dark Side in this movie and got beat by Ray, then yeah, the fans wouldn't be very happy. <laughs> they wouldn't be very happy because then, because then, because then it'd be silly. They, then, it, then it'd be really silly. Someone who's had no false training, uh, Jedi training whatsoever, beats a fucking like a Dark Side apprentice, a fully trained Dark Side like master, you know. At least fans can say, oh well, you know, at least we can say that, well, Kylo Ren, he was injured, he got blasted by Chewbacca's crossbow blaster, and he's not fully trained yet. So, those are the only two factors that went against uh, Kylo Ren's uh, chances of being Ren, Ray. And then, I've only, then you've got my theory that Ray is just very naturally gifted. He, she is very, very naturally gifted. And uh, she just, it just, you know, her skills with lightsaber just came naturally to her. And uh, yeah, so I just, that's my only theory that she is a, a natural when it comes to the uh, force. But anyway, anyway, look, thanks very much, guys, for stopping by, checking out this video. I hope you uh, enjoyed it. I hope to see you guys later on the next video. Bye. <laughs>